Hey guys, welcome back to Conversations with Juan and... And Tini. Hey Six, how you going? Good. Nice. Today we got a very simple one, very simple and useful. So, five things to include when writing a case study. Number one. Number one. So we're going to start with the problem, the client challenge. What were they dealing with before they started using your product or service? Number two is uh, what are the client goals? What do they want to achieve? Why are they here? And that's just going to set the ground off to what you're going to do for them. Number three. Number three. This is where we get the data, the hard facts. So we want a bit of quantitative results. That could be KPIs, social media, engagement metrics, depending on your project. What's next? Awesome. So the number fourth is usually you have all this information, everything's great, but it's good to show the examples of work. If it's a very creative campaign, you want to show the goodies you did at the end. So make sure you include some samples of work. Number five and last one. Number five, last one. So we'd love to get a testimonial from the client. Let them speak for your work. Get a quote. Yeah, that's a great idea. So if you need help with the case study, if you need more information, you know, just follow us or send us a comment. Sounds that's it. good. That's it. Bye. See ya. Chicky bam bam, blue melon. <laughs>